ルファンタジーゴース X コムサーガ Hello So today、uh, we're going to be tackling some of the DLC I believe this is called Alien Hunters and What it does is it gives you some new gear, and、uh, you've seen some of it already. And、uh, there are three super strong aliens、uh, that are released into the world. This is where, the, where you find the first one. I'm not sure if you have to do this mission before they start showing up. I'm not positive about that. I, I think they will, even if you don't. But I put this mission off because because this is Iron Man mode, and I did not want to get everybody killed. So I think this is an okay time to tackle this mission. We're a lot area, stronger.、Um, Sammy, Sammy with a Y, is on this species, mission. He's almost done with her training. Um, we've got power armor, which is the highest level of basic armor you can have. It increases your health by six and gives you one point of armor, which basically armor means if you get ten damage done to you, armor will absorb one damage and it becomes nine. Unless the armor gets shredded. And there are several ways that can happen. So, armor good. Ah,、uh, we got plasma weapons. Got the plasma rifle. Which is pretty nice.、Uh, plasma is the highest tier of weapons, at least for the standard XCOM 2, which is what I'm playing. I'm not sure if War of the Chosen has a higher tier than that.、Um, we also have Bradford on this mission. Who is who happens to be a ranger? So it's kind of a nice to see a ranger in the field again. He's like the he's like our executive officer. I don't know why he is. He's basically in charge of the ship. He runs everything for us. And the the way the the mission goes, we got like a mess. We got we found a transmission. And it's like it's got the voice from the doctor from the previous game, and it kind of sounds like he has the hots for her too. So this is personal. He's on this mission too. It's a plasma sniper rifle, by the way. So there's a lot of snakes in this mission. Snakes. Why did it have to be snakes? I guess I'll just talk about it here. Well, we have some breathing space, but、uh, what we're going after right now is something called an alien ruler, and it's like a special variant of a type of enemy. In this case. Happens to be the snake men or whatever they call them. I can't call them snake men. I think they're called vipers. But、uh, now they'll always be snake men to me.、Uh, uh, so normally, all the vipers we encounter are females, I think. And the one we're gonna fight at the end of this mission is a male viper. And、uh, they do this with the other two aliens of this of this kind. They just swap the genders of whichever one is the common ver variety.
Uh, they've got a tremendous amount of HP. Tremendous amount of armor. They have several special abilities usually. I think they all have more than one special ability that only they have. And the worst part is they they don't take turns. You know, this is a turn-based strategy game, right? So I move a character and then the enemy moves their character. Back and forth it goes. Well, alien rulers, you know, <laughs> They're more like real-time strategy characters inside a turn-based strategy game. They move... If every action you take, the alien ruler moves. Every single time. So, if you move one time, they move and attack. If you move again, they'll move and attack. If you shoot, they'll move and attack. So, when you're facing off against them, best thing to do is prioritize attacking and uh, the best way to deal with them is if you can inflict some kind of uh, damage like let's say you can if you can poison them give them an acid burn if you can uh, give them a regular burn That will, every time they move, they will take damage from that. So it's great, it's super effective against these guys. Don't fight. Let it happen. So here is Sammy. She can, you can literally take over an enemy and now they're just yours. You can do whatever you want with them for the whole, the whole mission. They can only do that to one enemy per mission, though, so it's not super. And some enemies are a lot harder to take over than others. But even having a weaker one is really nice because they can do some scouting for you without you having to worry about hurting one of your guys. And, uh,. I do believe that was an accident. Uh, I actually killed the snake I had under my control, which sucks. Kind of a waste there, but uh... Yeah, because I really wanted to see if I could constrict the, uh, the alien ruler at the end of the mission. But... Now my snake is dead, unfortunately. Snake, are you okay? Snake? Snake! So the, the story is the doctor from the previous game did all kinds of experiments here and she created these super powerful Aliens and they they got out. Why she did this? Ah, uh, who knows. But on the bright side, if you can kill these guys and take them back to your ship and research them, you can turn them into a a very powerful piece of armor. You only have one of them, but they're still really really good. Totally worth getting. You get some of the unique abilities that uh, the alien had. Appears to be the remnants of an alien genetics facility. With the damage to these containment units being so severe, I can only imagine the work that was being done here. Was she living out here? Uh, explaining it a little bit there. You can sort of see the holograms of the three aliens that we have to catch and kill. 
I personally think the Berserker is the worst one. He has the most, or I think that's a she actually, but whatever. Has the most HP. Okay, this mission is something else. On the move. There are definitely reasons why I waited to be this strong and uh, to do even on you know even on rookie. Do that mission until so, so I I'm really ready. that I'm being a little more cautious than I usually am because I kind of know what's up ahead and I don't want to be in a super bad position when things go down. I'm not really sure what the trigger is for the events. So. I bet she didn't take her own advice and avoid contact and didn't make them to begin with. Ah, but those Germans, they'd be mad scientists, you know. Once knew a guy named Hermann, spelled like German. And uh, he was a baker. And uh, he came from Peru. What was funny was we, we work at night and we worked at night. I don't work there anymore. And he was afraid of the dark. So the manager would shut off the lights and leave and then her mom would come back and turn all the lights back on and they were, they would get mad at him because he shut the lights off to save money, and he had them on all night, so... You get a little bit in trouble. Okay, here we go. It starts. This is one of my favorite abilities that the psionic operatives can do. It's called Lance. No, no Lance. It's kind of like Holy Explosion from Final Fantasy Tactics, but with better range, and you can do it diagonally. Also, basically, a directional attack hits everyone caught in it. Does a lot of damage. No one is safe. She's 
These are beasts. And she's she doesn't even have all her abilities yet. She's she's like she's like 80% there. So, you know, we were short on manpower, so I brought her out. <laughs> now, uh, when I was doing this mission, I was kind of falling asleep. So I'm probably gonna have to do wait a We'll do a fair amount of editing to try to cut some of the waiting out because I would just doze. Not so much full of sleep as just stare at the screen and be confused over what I was doing. Actually, at, this, at some point I, I stopped and I just saved the middle of the mission and came back and finished it later. to determine how many uh there's a fuckload though well that's not a scientific term Just in sight. Up, people. i think i think fuckload is part of the metric system so most most people don't know most americans don't know how much it is I feel like here in America, we do everything better and worse than everybody else at the same time. Hey, hey, our healthcare is great, but nobody can afford it. have the best cars, but watch out for those roads. I'm so slithering and sneaky because I'm a snake. So there's a lot of snakes in this mission. If this isn't like a, a walk in the park or whatever, but if we were playing on veteran, there'd be a lot more snakes, and they they come out like all at once practically. I remember the first time that it happened, I was just dumbfounded because I had done this mission before on Rookie on my first playthrough and I sort of knew what I was expecting and then when I got to this room and then fucking every snake in the world just comes out at once I'm like what's going on? I couldn't believe it somehow I made it through that room uh, I had I had a one or two rangers at the time who both had the um, whatever it's called. I think it's I know uh, Bradford over here has it. It's called cereal. 
Well, whatever it is. If you kill somebody with your with anything, I think. But I think it might be with anything, but I always use it with the sword. You get your action refunded, so if you can like create yourself a string of enemies, kind of like. <laughs> Levi Ackerman having like a string of titans. Nanda, Ore no Kyojin wa taorete. You can just kill snake after snake after snake after snake, which is pretty nice. I love abilities like that. Uh, the sniper has one similar. I'm on it. But it's easier to use it with the major. You don't miss as often with the sword. Yeah, I miss having a ranger on the team. Not that like I'm not that, like I'm a huge fanboy of the Ranger class, but I, don't, I would I think the best team is a team that has every type of unit. enemies I think they have two hit points which is pretty low I can't really tell some of them some of them have a lot more but most of them have like two or three hit points bad we killed the one we had under our control because that was one of the, the normal stronger ones I think I think this is where I try to pull off the move I didn't get I don't think I got as many as I would have liked but That's it, I only got two? Shit. I guess I couldn't see more. Oh, wait. Or it's not so good. <laughs> yeah, so pro tip bring rangers for this mission. Like six minutes of nothing happening, me creeping up, or just I must have like fallen asleep or something because I literally didn't move the cursor for one minute. Traces of human DNA. 
DNA deeper in the facility. It just might be. Just might be what? Tell me. I'm on pins and needles here. At least, at least he doesn't have a that juice. At least he doesn't have, I, I just might have to use that. I might have to use that. That nebulous thing that I'm not going to explain what it is. For 30 more chapters. Yeah, so it's like another, another four or five minutes of almost nothing happening. I mean, just creeping up slowly. And then I, I call it quits, and I saved it. So I'm just creeping forward again. I kind of know what I'm, I know what's going to happen. So I'm not quite sure what the trigger is. What I'm trying to do is to set up a bunch of my soldiers in Overwatch. The theory being the alien ruler is going to come out, and then there's, I want there to be like a line of troops ready to take that overwatch shot because overwatch shots don't count for actions so they're nice because that we get a bunch of free hits without him oh, taking yeah. you know taking any kind of action against us Got it. so I want to get I want to get most of my pulse rifle users on the floor there and uh, maybe get one sniper up top and I kind of want the David Horvath kind of in the thick of things because I gave him the uh, pistol ability where you can actually shoot at all the aliens in your line of sight. So if there's four, you can shoot at four. If there's more, you can shoot at more. It's, it's a pretty cool ability. Only with your pistol, though. So, it's still... It's actually pretty nice if you're up against a group of enemies. So uh, the bit rate's a little bit higher for this footage than it was for the, the previous footage. The internet seemed okay, so... This might be the best footage I've gotten so far. Except for stuff that I literally saved off my Xbox One. With, like, the DVR ability it has. They changed the app though. They had this app on Xbox One. It was called. Eh, what the hell was it called? Moving to Overwatch. Whatever. Well, they, ch they, they disabled it basically. It doesn't work anymore. It was so easy to upload clips to my OneDrive. I could list screenshots, I could list clips. Boom, 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 mark them off all at the same time and say upload them to my OneDrive. Boom, straight to my computer. Beautiful piece of cake. China. Okay. Now they don't want to support that anymore. You have to use this stupid app on my cell phone. Super slow. And the best I could do is email shit to myself one at a time takes forever. Basically, I can't 
rely on that anymore for anything. It's just too annoying. Location confirmed. And it's sad because it was great. It was a great app. see that show Dark. It's on Netflix. It's a German show. I actually really like it. Don't step over there, Cherokee. I could use the exercise. Okay, I think I just activated it. So this, you have to be careful here. By the way, if you haven't seen the show Dark, watch it. Or, or at least give it a chance. You know, it might not be up your alley. <clears throat> and no offense, but there are certain, like, languages that I just really... I have a hard time listening to Mandarin Chinese, uh, Arabic, uh, German. German is one of those languages. This is a very hard language. The sounds. Yeah, I'm just not a big fan. Of it. Normally, I I will always go subtitles all the time. There are some languages I will watch the dub version no matter how bad the dub is. No matter how bad. And let me tell you, the dubbing for Dark is bad. Real bad. <laughs> but I still I still watch it with the English dub. But the funny thing about that show. Uh, I don't, I don't want to spoil anything. They, they wax philosophic all the time. Like, every episode starts off like, What is real? What is really real? What if what wasn't real is it not still real? Or some shit. Every episode, usually multiple times per episode. I mean, it's weird because I also like Flamstein a lot. They sing in German, so I, I don't. I don't know what to tell you. I like the German accent. I just don't really like listening to the German language. It's just... I don't know. Who knows? Target neutralized. 
So this is the other thing about the alien rulers. Once you start fucking them up, uh, they will call a portal and leave. Usually you can't stop them unless they're really weak, because once they call that portal, portal pretty much, unless you have a cryo grenade, I think they will be gone after your next action. Unless your next action is to literally froze them, freeze them. And now that snake will appear in random missions with a small entourage of snakes. It could be, it could be a problem. It's not her. Central, I am not detecting any additional <laughs> Like, how, how does he know? Does she doesn't have a name tag. Is clear. Name tag, not her. So, okay, let me just tell you. I killed this snake. Actually, uh, at this point in time. I've killed all three of the alien rulers. They're all dead. Uh, turned the snake into its armor, and I'm working on the other two. Yep. <laughs> uh, the snake one and the floaty guy one are my favorites. I believe the floaty guy one gives you two bursts of flight that could make you move tremendously far. Uh, and I think at any elevation you want. And you can do that twice per mission. Just have those two free moves. You can use them like, I think, whenever you want. I guess they do. I don't, I think you can use them whenever well, I'm not positive. It's been a while. And the snake armor gives you a grappling hook and a freezing attack. Uh, the grappling hook is not unique to the snake armor. Uh, you can get that with another armor as well. 